Welcome back, Theme Park Wizard, and right now we're on the last of our IAPA videos. Monday we did the IAPA video for uh, looking at the Walt Disney World projects. Yesterday we did the one looking at Disneyland Resort projects, and today we're looking at the first looks or new looks at the international projects. And right now we're taking a look at the Hotel Marvel in or the Art of Marvel at the hotel at the hotel in Paris, like the Art of Hotel New York, New York Art of Marvel. Then you look the little Marvel re uh kind of overlay that, that this hotel is getting. It looks very very classy. This is the lobby. Only had a couple of new pictures. Got this is the rendering, and then I don't black and white still of what it looks like like right now, and it looks very this look looking very nice. You see, I think Captain America to the right and Scar Iron Man maybe to the or Captain America is to the left, Iron Man was to the right. Here's what it looks like right now in the black and that black and white still. <laughs> and the ladder up there. And the murals are getting ready to they're just about done. And then um still working very hard, but looks at least a lot of it looks almost just about complete. So that's pretty good. And um don't know when it's supposed to open. I'm, I think 2021 because it's just an overlay. But yeah, it looks like it will be opening very soon. Moving on to other portions of Disneyland Paris, we have the um, studio tour, the or it's not the studio tour, but the the backlot tram tour, which is now being rethemed as the Cars Route 66 road trip. And as you see, <laughs> this is the former. Canyon Blaster, or Blast Canyon, whatever they called it, um, area, and it's being painted in the blue Dynaco theming, so that should be cool. And Avengers Campus in Paris, which is just on the other side of, uh, well, by the way, this is the Walt Disney Studios Park at Disneyland Paris, the second park, not Disneyland Paris Park, uh, proper, the Castle Park, this is Walt Disney Studios Park, and we got uh, the studio, uh, uh, Cars Route 66 on the north side, and here on the south side, west side, we got Avengers Campus. And look at that, there's the um, building for the Spider-Man attraction. And the building behind that is the one I believe where the Rock and Roller Coaster, the former Rock and Roller Coaster is soon to be Iron Man Coaster. That's going to open next year. Their Spider-Man attraction building is a ground-up coaster, or ground-up building. It's going to be same thing as DCA or California Adventures, but they're putting theirs obviously from the ground up, so it's looking to take a little bit longer. I think that one's going to open in 2023, I believe, because um, uh, by the looks of it, they haven't even gone vertical with the building yet, although I'm not sure what the scaffolding to the right is, but... um. Now and stuff can take a while, but I'm sure they don't care too much as they get their roller coaster back on Iron as we themed as Iron Man um next year. And we didn't really get an update on that either. Um no coaster car updates or anything else. So I'm very curious to see what that will be like when it opens next year next year. And what the front of the building would be like. I know they started working that last um last year, but be very exciting. Moving on to Shanghai, construction's moving fairly quickly on the Zootopia expansion. It's basically just Zootopia Mini Land, as the main ride show building is right there in the white steel, as you can see. And then <laughs> there should be some surrounding shops and restaurants, and that's pretty much it. Not many details were released and are even known about the ride's uh, system. The ride system or anything about the ride, just they'll be you'll be zooming through the streets of Zootopia in a car, maybe something like this Indiana Jones system, or I don't know, I'm not entirely sure, but that's basically how big the land's gonna be there, as it's not too big. But it is the first Zootopia themed expansion or Zootopia themed land at any distant park in the world. And Speaking of things that are big, look at that castle that is massive in the center, and look at Tron, 
and the uh, swooping, glowing <coughs> Tron way over on the other side of the park. That is coming to Disney World, but could be significantly delayed as it was, was not mentioned in this presentation at all. By the way, these are all stills from the attractions videos Disney showed at the Expo on Monday. But what do you guys think about these international projects? Let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, give this video a big thumbs up. And stay tuned tomorrow, especially if you're Disneyland fans, because we'll all have, er, yeah, Disneyland fans, because we'll have a massive, massive Disneyland construction update thanks to some aerial image, images provided by Mice Chat. No show progress on the Fantasyland projects, the Haunted Mansion, all of which the scalping has been received, especially our scalping is down, and the mansion and the Snow White and Carousel got, especially Carousel got a nice bright new paint job, so that's pretty cool. But he finally, for the first time in a couple months, got a first new aerials of Avengers Campus, with a lot of the paving stones in, as well as theming on the restaurants and gift shops being just about 100% completed and looks just about ready to go. So definitely subscribe for that and stay tuned for that. And as always, have a fantastic day. Stay safe, stay safe out there.